right, you guys, I'm back with another DIY, whatever you want to call it. Just pick a name for the series, y'all. I don't even know what it's going to be called. You want me to sit down? I'm about to reupholster, cover this couch, um, and I'm going to do it a no so way. I got about this yarn here, I got about eight or nine yards. I know it's in a ball right now because I unraveled it to make sure I had enough. Looks like I'm going to have enough. I might have to go back and get more. But yeah, I'm about to cover all of this couch up. I know before we get into it, no, no. I'm not buying any couch covers. Know why? Because I can't find any couch covers that cover a C shape couch I have a C shape not an L or a U a C and um they really don't make couches look like this to be honest with you anymore and plus you it's hard for me to find a cover and when I do found it it's like two or three hundred dollars I'm like I can go buy a whole new couch for that type of coin I ain't got time for that so that's why I was like I'm going to reupholster it or just cover it myself until I get the money to buy the couch that I really really want and um yeah, that's about it. Oh, I don't know how to sew, so that's why I'm not sewing it either. And plus, I'm, if I did know how to sew, I'm lazy. I ain't about to do all that. Anywho, I'm done talking. Let's get into this video. Okay, I wanted to show you what I'm going to be using. I got some scissors. I got some, like, no sew fabric glue thing. I also bought a needle and thread just in case, you know, I want to do a little extra. I got me a staple gun and I got me some uh, one package of heavy duty staples but I'm thinking that I may need to go back to Hobby Lobby today and buy another one of these but yeah and then I like I said mentioned before I got this material that I got from Walmart I spent like ten dollars because it was in the clearance section and it's quite it's a bunch so and yeah I know it looks wrinkled but don't worry I do have a steamer so once I put it on if I can't stretch the wrinkles out I will use a steamer to stretch the wrinkles out and I also got a protective for over top of this fabric to um, make sure you know it can last a long time you guys I wanted to show you so far what I got done I oh my face look crazy but anyway I was look this is really hard <sighs> I have a new appreciation for people who do upholstery work seriously I'm still gotta tuck and do all that I wanted to show you how I um, got this part done so far and y'all I'm so hurt right now I have ran out of material. I have just enough to cover those, but I do not have enough to cover all those cushions over there. And um, when I bought this material, I bought the whole roll that was on there. And um, I don't, and I've been looking at. I don't. I don't even think they have any more at Walmart. So my cushions may just be a different color, and I don't know how that's gonna look. To be honest with you. Because I really didn't want it to look all bootleg. Completely bootleg. You know I wanted it to look semi bootleg. But not all the way. But anyway. So I'm getting a little discouraged. On um, how everything's going to turn out. I hope it turns out okay honestly. But yeah I'm going to continue to 
10 state girl my arms are sore this is a full workout all right you guys it is several days later uh several oh let me get my lighting together yo oh my gosh okay i think last time i left off i was trying to do my couch over and like halfway through my couch i realized that i did not have enough material i went to several different walmarts could not find the extra material and yeah so i got one i got a half a couch done half a couch now i got stuff on my couch you probably can't see because it's dark let me see if i can turn on the blinds maybe you can see Woo! blinding yo wow wow you can kind of can you see it you probably really can't you can't even see the difference it's a little dark brown black i'm gonna leave it the way it is right now um i want to buy a new couch anyway so that's a fail yeah this was definitely a fail but hey you live you learn you try you feel me but i'm gonna leave it the way it is i could just take the material right back off but i just don't feel like doing none of that and um we're me and the crew it's been a minute since i recorded me and the crew been sick we all had stomach situations so it was it was a hot mess up in this place let's just say <laughs> anyway so, but we're, I'm feeling much better today. Well, not much better. I'm just feeling better. So, I'm going to still finish. I'm still going to cover my pillows. I do got my material over there. I'm going to cover my pillows. And I'm going to cover uh, my computer desk chair. Plus, I'm going to change these blinds. These uh, blinds. Whatever you want to call it. Blinds. Curtains. Whatever you want to call them. Blinds. They're not blinds. They're curtains. Sabrina, get your life, girl. Yeah. Forgive me. My brain's fried. But anyway. This is how my pillows have came out so far. Um, once I put them on the couch, you can see how it will be arranged. But I just kind of want to show you. I might add some more pillows or change them out. But yeah, this is how it's looking right now. Here is the chair. Um, I think it didn't come out too bad. I like the way it looks. It looks different. All right, you guys. Um, don't mind that. That is just blankets I'm about to take upstairs. I just did a whole bunch of laundry. But, um, yeah, I changed my shirt because I got hot in the other one. But anyway, I'm now about to hang the curtain rods up. That's my one of my box lights. But anyway, I'm about to hang up my curtains. I just got some solid curtains. That's all. Nothing too bougie. I actually bought these. If you watch my 99 cent only hauls, you will saw them. In one of my hauls, I bought these and they were like $7.99. They're originally from Bed Bath & Beyond. So they're really nice quality curtains. I'm really excited to, um, and they're really long. I love long curtains. They make everything look long. They're like my favorite. But anyway, so I am going to hang these suckers up. I did get a curtain rod. Be careful when you buy stuff online, y'all. So I bought this curtain rod, and it was supposed to be gold. And it's not gold, y'all. After when I put everything together, I have so much I got to tell you about this experience, yo. It's like epic fail. Everything isn't coming out. My couch didn't come out right. My pillars are looking lopsided, but whatever. We're going to we're going to keep them. And my curtain rod, look how tiny this is. I thought it was going to look something 
like that big you see how that's big but then it came out like some little baby little baby looking things whatever I'm so over it right now you guys <laughs> I'm so over this right now but it's all right I'm gonna throw everything together I can't wait till you guys watch the finished result videos make sure you are subscribed but anyway enough of this talking let me get back into hang up these curtain rods y'all y'all I end up keeping the same curtain rod because I just didn't it was just too small so that's something I can't hang in the kids rooms or whatever but yeah this is what it's looking like right now all right you guys so I look tired Ooh, yeah but anyway what I was gonna say yeah I, I'm gonna call this the DIY epic fail that was one reason why I didn't really want to do too many DIYs with this project because a lot of the stuff I was just sampling out guessing and just figuring out myself because I am not a upholstery person i really don't know how to sew that well to be honest with you i've learned how to, i know how to sew a button that's pretty much all i know how to do when it comes to sewing and i don't have a sewing machine it is what it is i'm perfect i'm happy with everything the way it's turning out so far uh, i'm the next video or the next thing i'm about to do right now but i don't know when that when y'all will see it um hopefully soon i hope you guys are liking these vlogtober videos because yo your girl has been working really hard trying to put get these videos i got some in my eye Anyway, I hope you guys are liking these Vlogtober videos because I've been working really hard on them for you. I'm going to be cleaning my carpets. Once I clean my carpets, I'm going to do the big reveal of my living room so you guys can see how everything looks, how is, everything is turning out. I am going to go back to 99 to add a couple more things in here just to give it that extra little bam, bam, bam that I'm doing. And I might want to change some of the things up here in my little bookshelf you know just to make things look just perfect how i really wanted it but so far you know what i'm happy it is what it is um eventually i'll end up getting me a new couch um yeah that couch was definitely an epic fail but whatever what you gonna do what you gonna do crack no i'm gonna keep it pushing hey you know is what it is um i hope you guys liked it if you have if this is your first time watching my videos make sure you guys check um make sure, you, make sure you guys are subscribed of course but make sure you guys check out the whole series i did my wall gallery um i did what else i did my wall gallery i did my bookshelf um i painted my chairs i did some painting so make sure you check out all those videos um my next video is going to be cleaning my carpet. Make sure you check that video. Then the big reveal. How everything's going to look. And I just go into detail showing you guys where I got everything. Why I put it there. It is what it is. And just to let you know. I know somebody's going to say. Are you going to re rearrange your furniture? No. No. Because the way it, my furniture is, is placed here for a reason. And it's going to stay here for a reason until I move. I'm just going to end up getting a new one. But I understand you guys are, it's, you guys are, you know, saying it with, you know, because you guys just, whatever. But no, I'm, I've, no, I'm not changing my furniture. I know somebody's going to ask me that. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. <laughs> and no, I'm not. But when I move, I'll be rearranging and everything. But um, make sure you guys check my life updates, those videos. All right, y'all. I'm done rambling, I swear. <laughs> if y'all still here I'll catch you guys in my next video and as always guys god bless Mwah.